there was this party for Ezra Toza. <laughs> leaving a New York hospital after more than a month in the ICU. Because you've been so strong and brave. We first met the five-year-old last May when he desperately needed a liver transplant. She's a perfect match. Are you serious? Yeah. Oh and showed you the moment his preschool teacher, Carissa Fisher, stepped in with this life-saving surprise. I'm going to share my liver with you, buddy. The surgery this summer, a success. Ezra's mom, Karen, forever grateful. We feel so blessed to, you know, have kind of formed a bond. And we're just incredibly, incredibly grateful. And how's this for a celebration? That's beloved Northern California school custodian Pedro Alvarado Reyes taking a victory lap on his very last day. Students and staff at Montebello Elementary marking his retirement with cheers of thanks for taking care of them and the school for more than a decade. There was such joy Let's go, Charlie. at South Carolina's Clemson University. That's Charlie McGee finding out he got into Pi Kappa Alpha and then running into the arms of his new fraternity brothers. The guys say they chose Charlie, who has Down syndrome, because of his values and his involvement in Clemson life and service to school and community. And in St. Louis, the SLU high school football team winning off the field. Oh my God. <laughs> there they are, more than 30 of them, all getting their head shaved to support a teammate's loved one who's battling brain cancer. Defensive end Patrick Laffey organized it all to show seven-year-old Nora Bunn just how much she means. That's Nora in the pink hat, even helping out along with her big sister. Patrick, what made you decide to do that? I just want to show her that, you know, I, I'm always going to have her back and anything that she's going through is something that I'm going through too. I don't want her to go through this alone. For this family guided by faith, the gesture meant everything to Nora's parents. Brent and Janie, what was it like for you? As Patrick said, we have to support each other. In this dome of darkness, people keep showing up and poking holes of light and there was a huge hole of light poked through our dome of darkness that day. Thanks for watching. Stay updated about breaking news and top stories on the NBC News app or follow us on social media.